So the primary rationale for banning TikTok is national security. Lawmakers argue that ByteDance could be secret, secretly controlled by the Chinese government, which has laws compelling companies to assist with intelligence gathering. There are fears the Chinese government could use TikTok to spy on Americans, collect personal data, spread it misinformation, and manipulate content. This is absolutely true. Uh, there's been many, many, many instances of where the interest of the U.S. have been compromised by not only the Chinese, but the Russians, uh, the Indians, uh, even the Iranians have read stories have expressed an interest in sowing the seeds of dissent in this country. And the Chinese have long, have a long history of this type of behavior. So again, I certainly understand the need for some separation of the two companies. The bill does face an uncertain path in the Senate. Now, the House bill passed with bipartisan support from both both houses or both um, parties in Congress, Democrats and Republicans. And President Bush has indicated he would sign it. The les- legislation faces a more uncertain future in the Senate. Some senators have expressed reservations about the bill's constitutionality and impact on free speech. The bill may be amended to extend the divestment period for ByteDance for a period of up to a year. So there's going to be some le- um, legitimate constitutional concerns here with respect to free speech and the chilling of free speech. TikTok is a huge, huge platform. 